to. Try not to touch them, because... Yeah, we're just gonna try not to touch the letters, especially because they yeah. are not on with the right yeah, kind yeah. of marker, so they're gonna That's slide awesome. around if you touch them too much. Yes. See, there's already, like, red purple all over my finger. Yeah, and then mine... And mine just needs hot gluing to the actual thing, which to the actual suit, which we haven't even made yet. I think in the next one, right now we're just making the apron. Yeah, I think we're gonna just make the, uh, that is. In action, yep. Hot glue in action. It's in action, right? I'm gonna cut some of this, some of the ribbon and stuff. Hot glue is always tricky because it's like a little stringy. But it seems like but it's, it's working. It's definitely better than sewing this by hand because we do not have a sewing machine. Guys, I think this is definitely better. You know what I mean? And the felt will work really well with the hot glue. Some of the other fabrics might not work as well, so we'll have to just think about when we're going to need to sew it and when we're going to need to work with it. But that looks pretty nice. So the only problem is really just that there's like color getting everywhere. So I don't know if I'm gonna be able to do that bad, but we need to just leave it alone and let it dry a bit. Yeah, we need to put a hair dryer to it. Okay. Um I'm gonna look for something. So I just cut out, while you were doing this, cut out this piece of cloth, and I'm going to use it around this bowl of tinfoil. As you can see, I'm just wrapping it. And now that's going to be the base of the cupcake. I'm pretty sure. Oh, that's it. Okay, I'm going to use this together. Sorry everyone. Yeah. Sorry. What do you mean to? Cut glue on tin foil. See how that works, huh? Yeah, we can still use that to give it some structure. Yep. Okay. Oh, and guys. Just a reminder, always be careful yeah. using hot glue. Um, you should let your parent or a, have adult supervision to help you with this because it is super dangerous. Yeah, and, and, and I, I recommend doing it, doing it with yourself with parent supervision because obviously you don't want to like unless you're a parent is obviously like I'd say like once you become a teenager. Yeah, I have definitely burned myself with hot glue before. It's not fun, guys. So, the whole tinfoil ball is hot right now because of all the hot glue that's around it. And tinfoil isn't really good. Isn't really a thing that cools down when it gets warmed up. It, it gets warmed up with the stuff. Because it's made for getting warm, so... Imagine it's so hot, we just light a fire. Oh, wait. So, sorry, guys. This is a quick interruption. Table pants. Cute. What, what do you want me to do? Just not show how cute you are? Okay, so now we have this little fluffy cotton ball. 
which we can cover in this fabric. To make it into a cupcake. I think we should kind of cut it a little bit differently though because to make it like a cupcake I want it to be kind of round. So it folds better and I'm probably gonna have to cut some little slits in it. Mm -hmm. You can't really look because I'm doing everything else for you. Little bobble. Chunky's was a bobble head. Bobble cat. Okay. Bobble head. Bobble cat. Bobble cat. Bobble cat. Wait, no. He's a good bobble head. He's right there. He's our good friend. Okay. So we just made a nice little round, like, circular okay guys see y'all on next video peace